gentlemen, we don't lose the dress room. Remember, obey my commands all the time, protect yourself at all times. Any questions over here? Questions over here? Touch gloves, step back, let's get started. Gavin, do you know if there's any history between these two? Not that I know, but there seems to be a touch of tension. Yeah. I know I know. Aaron takes his fighting very seriously. I mean, he's coming back after 18 months after a loss to Joe Sam Perry. And, uh, you know, it's a hometown thing. He wants this win. Martinez coming uh, right out with a head kick right away. Basically, almost to establish dominance. Like, yep. I can kick you in the head if I feel like it. Absolutely. Martinez throwing that hook, but leaving that right door really big and open. Martinez is corner saying to watch the leg kick. Nice speed on uh, Aaron Fisher. That, that he threw upstairs kind of slow though. Aaron's a very rangy long fighter. A good teeth that backs up Martinez. Starting to find his timing. The crowd is really going crazy for Fisher here. He's got a good following in New York City. Popular fighter, very popular coach. Runs a really good school up in Midtown. Now that really beautiful and powerful teep that backs up Martinez. Martinez better find a, an antidote for that quick. What it's doing is it's letting Fisher establish uh, his confidence. You see the, the confidence growing on Fisher as he lands that right hand straight down the middle and a big leg a kick. A big leg kick in the teeth. I believe that was a slip. Fisher just throwing leg kicks without even, you know, throwing his hands. He's just kind of yep. expecting Martinez just to not check them. Well, I got a, it's funny, I've been getting people ringing in like all night asking about like, oh, Aaron, what's your opinion? What do you think Aaron's going to do? And a couple of guys who have fought Martinez, says, if he throws low kicks, he'll be fine. Martinez, uh, you're saying, is, has great Sus low kicks? Suspect for the low kicks. You know, doesn't, doesn't tend to check his kicks. Is he heavy on his feet? Do you believe that he's heavy on his feet and that's that's part of the problem? Doesn't Do seem like from here watching, he doesn't seem heavy on his feet. No, he, he, he is to... lifting his front leg. Oh, and beautiful. Aaron, going Aaron just town. unloading. Trying to get Martinez in the corner and just unloading with punches and bunches and combinations. Nice body kick there. Fisher has Martinez in the corner. He's got him against the ropes. Spins oh, him and dumps, dumps him to him. the canvas. Martinez is affected by this too. I believe possibly the wind is knocked out of him. He's standing eight here. Is he going to continue? Leaves his mouthpiece Mouth just hanging out. out in the middle of the ring. Now, it's definitely not a good sign when a fighter spits out his mouthpiece. Calling that save by the bell. Ladies. And you can see some bruising already on the, the left thigh of James Martinez. Aaron Fisher just pumping out that jam. A really nice jab that lands by Martinez. Another leg kick lands. Martinez really trying to unload with his hands. Oh, oh, big right hand, and we could see wobbles Martinez. Another standing eight. Martinez looks a little bit ticked off about the standing eight. I mean, it looked like his lights were about to go out, though. Aaron is just trying to stay on top of it. 
Aaron needs to decide how he wants to go about this. And Martinez is like throwing wild hooks on this. Another leg kick, you can see it. The Martinez wins on that one. Left elbow by Fisher. Another right huge elbow. right elbow oh. that knocks Martinez down to the canvas. This is the second standing aid. I, I don't know. Martinez trying to get back to his feet, Ref and it is it. over. It is over. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Vinny Chappell calls a halt to this contest. The official time of the stoppage, one minute and 16 seconds of round number two. Your winner by knockout from New York City, Aaron the Ghost Fisher.